Welcome back, everyone. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of rare diseases that have been discovered in 2024. Now, I know what you're thinking, rare diseases? But trust me on this, these aren't just medical curiosities. These discoveries are pushing the boundaries of medicine and biology, offering new insights into the human body. We're talking about the kind of stuff that seems straight out of science fiction, but it's all too real for the people affected. So buckle up because we're about to explore some of the most baffling medical mysteries of our time. All right, guys, let's talk about CRISPR. You know that revolutionary gene editing technology we thought was going to change everything? Turns out it's not all sunshine and roses. Researchers have identified a new condition, post-CRISPR syndrome, and it's got the medical community buzzing. Imagine this. You undergo gene editing for a debilitating genetic condition and it works. You're cured. But then, months or even years later, bam, you get hit with a wave of strange symptoms, chronic fatigue that just won't quit, muscles wasting away, and your own immune system turning against you. That's the reality for a small but growing number of people who've undergone CRISPR therapy. Now, it's important to note that post-CRISPR syndrome is still incredibly rare, and we don't fully understand what's causing it. Some scientists believe it could be the result of unintended off-target edits in the genome, while others suspect it might be an autoimmune response triggered by the edited cells. Whatever the cause, post-CRISPR syndrome raises some serious ethical and medical concerns about the long-term safety of gene editing. We're literally talking about tinkering with the very blueprint of life, and we're still figuring out the potential consequences. This is a developing story, and we need more research to understand the risks and ensure the safety of these groundbreaking therapies. We've all dreamed of going to space, right? Floating weightlessly, gazing at the stars. But what if I told you that space travel could have a hidden cost, one that affects you even after you return to Earth? Enter zero-G bone deterioration syndrome, a newly discovered condition that's got astronauts and scientists seriously concerned. Imagine training for years, enduring grueling physical challenges, finally achieving your dream of going to space, only to return and find out your bones are brittle and prone to fractures, almost like you've aged decades in a matter of months. That's the reality facing some astronauts who've spent extended periods in microgravity. Without the constant pull of Earth's gravity, bones lose density at an alarming rate. And while astronauts undergo rigorous exercise routines to combat this, it seems some individuals are more susceptible to this bone loss than others. The really scary part? This deterioration can continue even after returning to Earth, leaving astronauts vulnerable to fractures and long-term bone health issues. Researchers are working tirelessly to understand why some astronauts are more susceptible and to develop countermeasures that go beyond simple exercise. This isn't just about space travel, guys. Understanding zero-G bone deterioration syndrome could lead to breakthroughs in treating osteoporosis and other bone diseases right here on Earth. We rely on our senses to navigate the world around us, but what happens when those senses become our tormentors? That's the reality for individuals suffering from hypersynesthesia complex, a rare neurological disorder that turns everyday sensations into an overwhelming assault. Imagine a world where the hum of a refrigerator sounds like a jackhammer, the scent of freshly cut grass triggers a migraine, or a gentle touch sends searing pain through your body. For people with hypersynesthesia complex, the brain's ability to filter and process sensory input goes haywire, leading to a constant state of sensory overload. This can manifest as debilitating headaches, extreme sensitivity to light and sound, nausea, and even temporary blindness or paralysis. Imagine living in a world where every sensation is amplified to an unbearable degree. It's isolating, it's debilitating, and it can make even the simplest tasks feel impossible. Researchers believe hypersynesthesia complex may be caused by an overactive nervous system or a disruption in the brain's sensory processing centers. There's currently no cure, and treatment focuses on managing symptoms through a combination of medication, therapy, and sensory modification techniques. By studying hypersynesthesia complex, we can gain a deeper understanding of how the brain processes sensory information and potentially develop new treatments for chronic pain, sensory processing disorders, and even anxiety and PTSD. Chapter four, Levodynia, the mystery of left-sided pain. Pain is a universal human experience, but what happens when pain has no obvious cause, no visible injury, and seems to target one specific side of your body? That's the baffling mystery of levodynia, a newly recognized condition characterized by chronic, unrelenting pain localized to the left side of the body. Imagine a constant ache, a burning sensation, or a stabbing pain that never lets up, all concentrated on the left side of your body. For people with levodynia, this pain disrupts their lives, making it difficult to sleep, work, or engage in everyday activities. What's even more perplexing is that there are often no other symptoms, no underlying medical conditions that could explain this relentless pain. Some theories suggest that levodynia might be a type of neuropathic pain, meaning it originates from a dysfunction in the nervous system itself. It's possible that the brain is misinterpreting nerve signals from the left side of the body, leading to the perception of pain where there is no physical damage. Researchers are working to unravel the complex mechanisms behind levodynia, exploring potential links to the autonomic nervous system, inflammation, and even psychological factors. By understanding how and why levodynia occurs, we could unlock new treatments for chronic pain conditions that defy traditional explanations. 
Chapter 5. CDRD. When your body clock goes haywire. Our bodies are governed by internal clocks or circadian rhythms that regulate everything from sleep-wake cycles to hormone production. But what happens when these internal clocks go haywire? That's the challenge facing individuals with circadian dysregulation resilience disorder, or CDRD, a newly discovered condition that disrupts the body's ability to adapt to changes in light and dark cycles. Imagine a world where you never feel fully awake, where fatigue drags you down no matter how much sleep you get. That's the daily reality for people with CDRD. Their bodies struggle to synchronize with the 24-hour day-night cycle, leading to a cascade of debilitating symptoms. We're talking about persistent fatigue, insomnia, mood swings, difficulty concentrating, and even an increased risk of metabolic disorders like diabetes and obesity. Think about it, your internal clock is responsible for so much more than just when you feel sleepy. It affects your hormone levels, your metabolism, even your cognitive function, so when that clock is out of whack, it can throw your entire system out of balance. Researchers believe CDRD may be caused by a combination of genetic predispositions and environmental factors, such as exposure to artificial light at night and frequent travel across time zones. There's currently no cure for CDRD, but treatments like light therapy, melatonin supplements, and behavioral interventions can help manage symptoms and improve quality of life. Chapter 6, Encephaly X, Unraveling the Mystery of Brain Degeneration. The human brain is the most complex organ in the known universe, but what happens when this intricate network starts to break down? Encephaly X, a newly discovered and terrifying neurodegenerative disorder, is giving us a glimpse into the devastating consequences of brain degeneration. Imagine a slow but relentless decline in cognitive function, memory loss that erases precious memories, and personality changes that leave you feeling like a stranger in your own body. That's the heartbreaking reality for individuals diagnosed with Encephaly X. This rare and aggressive disease causes progressive hardening and shrinkage of brain tissue, leading to a wide range of debilitating symptoms, including severe dementia, speech difficulties, and loss of motor skills. What makes Encephaly X particularly frightening is its rapid progression. Unlike other neurodegenerative diseases like Alzheimer's, which can take years or even decades to develop, Encephaly X can progress rapidly, sometimes over a matter of months, leaving individuals and their families grappling with a devastating diagnosis. While Encephaly X is incredibly rare, it's sending shockwaves through the medical community because it doesn't seem to discriminate, affecting individuals across different ages and backgrounds. Wow, guys, in 2024, these rare diseases stretched our minds and our medical understanding, uncovering new corners of human biology. It's humbling and a little bit scary, right? But remember, this is cutting edge stuff. We're talking about conditions that are just starting to be understood. Although rare, each of these conditions has helped us gain valuable insights that might lead to better treatments for more common diseases. Who knows what breakthroughs are on the horizon? Thanks for joining us on this journey of discovering the rare disease discoveries of 2024. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on more fascinating medical mysteries.